Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to talk to you a little bit about Mayor of East Town. And I'm not going to give you too many spoilers. I'm going to give you just enough so you can get an idea what the show is about. It's really good. It premiered last night on HBO Max. Um, the star of it is Kate Winslet. She's doing a really good job so far, but she never plays any BS. So she's doing a good job at the uh, what she's of uh, the character of who she's playing. Okay, so um, it's a limited HBO series. Okay, and it's a lot going on. Um, East Town is in Pennsylvania. It's a small town. Everybody knows everybody on a first name basis. Okay. They all grew up together. They know this person's mom, dad, whatever. They all work in the community. They know everybody. So you know how small towns are. All right. Well, now, uh, Kate Winslet, who is mayor, she has like, she's rough. She's very rough around the edges. She's very rough around the edges. Um, she got this block on her shoulder, you know, like, oh my God, like nothing else. Um, but she's the detective um, in that town. And a little girl went missing a year ago. And the girl's mother was on the news. But the girl's mother who's on the news was her, was Mayor's classmate or teammate when it was on the basketball team. Because Mayor's nickname is, the, is, is Lady Hawk. Okay? And she hates me call that. So, they're at the reunion and they lined up because they're going to call names to get to present each person with an award for the 25th year anniversary. So, she gets online and Mayor tells her, you should have told me um, instead of going to the news and blasting, you know, what's going, the, 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 the police officers, you should have talked to me. And she said, Mayor, it's not about you. You know, she kept saying it over and she told her friend, you better get off of me, get off of me because the girl, mom, that's the girl that's missing. Her mom has cancer. So, of course, Kate Winslet keep going in and in and in until they called the girl's name. So she went out and got her award and they called Mayor's name, which is Kate Winslet. So wait, when Mayor went, I keep calling her Kate, but Mayor went out and she was limping. Now, I'm not sure if she got that limp from years on a job or she got the limp when she chased down the guy um that was doing drugs and stuff like that i'm not sure if she chased him down because she tried to drop the fence and she fell and hurt herself so i'm not sure if she got it then okay so now that happens now we're gonna jump to erin okay no we're not gonna jump to erin we're going to talk about mayor meets this guy at the bar he's new in town OK, he's a writer. He's a book writer. I wonder why book writers always go to small towns where they're not known. I guess to get a breath of fresh air, you know, to be not known and just to relax, or whatever. But he's new in town. OK, so. um, They have a conversation and all of a sudden she's at his house and she's giving up the goods. So she tells him this is a one time thing. It's like a she did like a you know slam bam thank you ma'am type thing but i i think it's gonna drag on a little bit because he's interested in kate mayor she's he's interested in her so i think you know she just got a rock so off but i think he's gonna be around for a little bit erin erin is a sweet girl she's a nice girl but she got pregnant and she has a son and she got a son by this goofball named dylan and Dylan is dating this girl named Brianna, who's all up in their business, where she should not be, okay? And she has this thing for Erin, I guess, because Erin looks better than her, because this girl is not it. But she's bullying Erin, but her boyfriend, well, her, yeah, Dylan doesn't do anything about it, doesn't tell her to stay in her place or nothing, lets her stay where he wants, say what she wants to say to Erin. Erin is not a person that fights. You can tell she's very, she's not confrontational at all. She's very timid in a way. Um, you know, she lives with her father, you know, who's got an attitude, you know, because he's always, I pay for the kid. I do this, I do that. I don't know where her mom is. I guess they'll get into that in the next episode or so. But she get a text. 
she thinks she's been texting this guy, but comes to find out Brianna's been catfishing her. So the guy tells her to come to the trail because she, you know, rides her bike to this open party in the wood area. And she goes up there and she's surrounded by Brianna and her friends and oh, her baby father is there too. Brianna punches Erin in the face beats her up, kicks her, stomps her, and all kind of stuff. A guy is video camera, you know, taking cap video of it. And Dylan is just standing there saying nasty things into the camera about Aaron. And I'm like, what type of, you know, you're a goofball. You, you, I really want to say something else, but YouTube might, might be in this video. And I'm like, yo, he is a DRCK, for real. And I'm like, I don't like him. I don't like him. And I can't stand Brianna. And we only one episode in. I can't stand either one of them. You know. Um, and he just allowing this to happen. So Shabon, who is Mayor's daughter, her and her friends stopped the fight. And she told Aaron, come on, let's come with me. Let's get you home. And she didn't want to go. So Aaron walks the trail to go back. Now, I'm going to go a little bit further. Because like I said, I want to give you more details but i don't i want you to see the first episode first and about the second episode i'm gonna spill all the beans okay so as the show was getting ready to go off they showing everybody doing their daily activities or whatever the case may be um they, they show dylan with the baby and he's crying because he has to have an operation for his ears he's crying and he's consoling him and you can see brianna in the bed irritated Baby, you knew he had a son, okay? You're so worried about the mama, you need to be helping out with that baby. But I don't think Brianna's going to be in there for the long roll because of the situation. Now, it goes to the bridge and it goes into the creek or the lake, wherever it is, with the rocks. I think it's um, like a creek. And Aaron is laid out on the creek, rocks, um, with a big gash over her head, over her eye. Now, who killed her? She's dead. Who killed her? Now, remember, her bike is still at the, in, at the in the woods where the party was. Her bike is still there. So, who killed Eric? Now, what's going to happen is what I think. I think Brianna is going to be a suspect. Okay? I think Dylan, he's going to be a suspect, as they both should. Who else is a suspect? I'm going to say... This new guy that came to town, because he is very new, but it could be somebody that lived there all their lives. So it's kind of like a who did it, like you know, who did this, who who done it, who done it, who did it. You know, it's, it's very mysterious. I like it. I love stuff like this. I'm telling you, I don't give y'all no BS to watch, but I think you guys need to get up on this and watch it, and let me know in the comment section how you like it, or if you are watching it, let me know how you feel about this episode. Um, that happened last night. <sighs> it's going to be kind of hard to determine who did what. It's going to be kind of hard to determine who did what. But, um, oh, and Erin, she is Kevin Bacon's daughter. Okay, so there's a the young lady that's missing, right? Her name is Katie Bailey, and Katie's mother is Dawn. Okay, Katie's mother is Dawn. Dawn has cancer, and she is basically... Um, how can I say? Hmm. She's okay. Dawn is Mayor's high school basketball teammate. Okay. And that's the one who went on TV and said the police aren't doing anything. Her daughter just disappeared into thin air a year ago. And so Dawn and Mayor has some words. Okay. Um, I don't know. It could be. I don't know who it could be. I don't know. And that's what we got to find out next Sunday. I hate that. But I hope I didn't spoil it for you guys. I just wanted to give you enough 
just so you it could pique your interest to watch the show. It's really good. If you into this type of stuff, it's crime, it's thriller, it's um suspense, all that kind of all of it. If you like that kind of stuff, you would enjoy this. You would enjoy this. So that's all I have for you right now, guys. I will talk to y'all later. I don't know what's going on with my 600 pound life. It seemed like there's no new episodes, but okay, if it does come back on, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But I'm into this right now. So every week I'll be coming through with, you know, what's happening in each episode, if you don't mind. All right. All right. So you guys have a good one and I will talk to you later.